Staff in the intensive care unit spend a lot of time with family members. We had one patient that was here, I believe, for about five or six weeks. I mean, that's, that's wild to think about. Celebrating victories with patients who overcame their illness and sharing in the sadness when they succumb to them. You'll lose a patient and then you literally have to turn around and you go into your next room and you have to act happy because you want to celebrate their wins. If a night shift nurse like Shannon is talking to a family during a late night visit, our conversations are usually more somber. Focusing on keeping patients comfortable and working with families during those precious final moments. It felt strange to spend all the time with someone, you get to lose people, and I didn't know what to do. Then Shannon thought back to her own experience. 11 years ago here, I had a stillborn daughter right down the hall, labor and delivery, and they gave me this beautiful box filled with stuff that to this day, even 11 years later, I cherish. No matter who you are or what you're being treated for. Here in the ICU, at some point, everybody's on a monitor, depending, you know, so we do have, you know, access to that. Knowing she could print the reading of a patient's heartbeat. I just bought glass bottles off Amazon, brought a hundred of them, brought them in, printed out some heartbeat strips um, for people who had passed for their family members to have something to remember them by. Though reactions to the tiny container were largely positive. That didn't feel like enough, so I started coming up with these comfort boxes. Adding fingerprints, support pamphlets, and anything else to help ease the pain of their loss. We're gonna kind of make the heartbeat bottles a little more formal. Right now they're just plain glass bottles. The small token gives families a way to carry part of their loved one home with them. We just want people to know that we're still thinking of them. And yeah, during this, you know, it's a horrible time. Try to ease a little bit of what we can do. Even though it's late at night and families aren't around to see it. We still spend just as much time with their family member, you know, behind the scenes. Shannon says she hopes the gift will show people that they did all they could. Their loved one mattered and was cared for. For Arnett Health, I'm Lexi Cutmore.